way to the ring, representing the Judgment Day from Bray County, Wicklow, Ireland. Weighing in at 180 pounds, J.D. McDonough! Trained by Finn Balor, inherited that same killer instinct. And McDonough's absolutely not here to make friends. He's here just to fight and win. I don't think J.D. could make a friend even if he tried. Well, if JD's the Irish ace, I guess that makes you the Joker, Saxton. Or maybe that rules card that everyone just throws out. Yo, yo, what's good, peeps? I'm Chillax, or Jake, whatever you want to call me. I hope everyone is having a fantastic day. As always, if you're new here, link yourself to a 2K account, then go to online options and make sure crossplay is turned on so you know for a fact that you can download the following images created by Crooked Alloy. Definitely go check this dude out on YouTube, absolutely talented individual who deserves every bit of love. This video would not be possible without Crooked Alloy. There's a link in the description to his channel. He hasn't posted JD McDonough's entrance video yet, so go subscribe to him and turn notifications on so you know for sure when he does. And I'll be sure to link the video in the description as well. To find the images, search JDMTron24 and I upload uploaded 10 images that are numbered in the description right to left 1 through 10. If you can't find the images under JDMTron24, try JD McDonough or Yo Chillax. Once you're finished downloading the images, I recommend creating the video afterwards as all images will be in the correct order. If you download something else, the images might appear scattered, so just keep that in mind. Now we go into video, you want to click image animation, custom images, and you'll notice all images are in order from top to bottom. For the first image, you want to find the animation that doesn't make any animation. Move the image to the left until it stops. And if the image doesn't stop for you, my suggestion is to cut out a white piece of paper with a straight edge and tape it to the middle of the canvas. You stretch the images and just do the best you can to line them up. The goal here is to make the image touch the top and bottom of the canvas evenly, then press right on the D-pad 38 times. I set the length of all images to 40 milliseconds and this is all personal preference. You can do whatever you want. Then I place the first image onto the middle layer. Moving on, the second image is pretty much the same process. Find the animation that doesn't make any animation, move it to the right until it stops, stretch it vertically until it's even, and then press right on the D-pad 38 times. I place the second image onto the top layer layer because sometimes there's a line that appears in the middle of the canvas. If you place the images like so, you shouldn't see any lines. Here's the final piece. If you have any questions, just let me know in the comments. On to the entrance formula. You can pretty much copy as you wish. I changed the intro, stage, and ramp motions to Tropical Cyclone. The nameplate is still glitched, so I wouldn't try messing around with that. Also, unfortunately, as of this video, using an alt attire for JD McDonough defaults his entrance to Dominic Mysterio. Something like this happened with Bianca Belair, and they patched it pretty quickly, so hopefully we get the same result for JD McDonough. Other than that, we should be good. Thank you all for watching. Hit that like button if you enjoyed the video and stay cool, stay chillaxed. Peace.